gold for the pro. Stock taker. Very patient Wolf from Long Island, New York. Wolf is going to be the start. We can see that Wolf switch out to the bench at any point. But yeah. It's going to be Wolf that starts it off. It was close last time these two played, but Sinji managed to edge it out. I really, taking it to FD at the get-go, that's, that's bold. That's definitely very, very bold considering this is Pac-Man's best stage. I feel like it's going to be a matter of confidence on Stock Taker's half for how well he's going to be able to, to land. Mix up those landings. Same thing with the return to the ledge. And then how well can he just deny space for Pac-Man? Oh my god, he's doing a great job doing it thus far. Just checking him with these nares. Oh, he uh, parried it, but then ran back in and said, Nah, that wasn't fair, man. I'm sorry. I'll give it to you. I think he tried to grab it. I like, I like the effort. Zone breaking Sinji is like a mini game in its own right. Because you have to be careful about what you're choosing to check and how you do so. Wolf's full hop is such a great tool for checking what an opponent can do. You can see the slight hesitation from Sinji there on that hop in for what he was going to do, but Stock retreating because he knew if he overcommitted with that double jump, he would have gotten hit. Like the, new, the display of nooch right now between these two players is wild. Oh, yeah, that's a freebie. Ball this jump. Air Dodge is helping out. And first blood broken in favor of Sinji. Yeah, Sinji does play the patient game really, really well, so it's gonna be it's gonna be a game of chess between these two for the majority of the set. We're probably not gonna be seeing any quick stocks anytime soon. It's just gonna be a, a pretty it's it, it's gonna be a marathon. So strap in kids, get your popcorn, get your stromboli, get what you need to get through this set. Do we have do we have any food or drink sponsors for this event? Uh no. Get your G Fuel. No. Oh my god. <laughs> So get him out of the air is what we need. Oh, wow. That <laughs> I just stopped. He's just been surviving on the ledge. Like, he's hanging by a thread. Like, he's not having a good time. Sinji, though? Big chilling. Yeah. And forward Dead. smash will net out that stock. This is such an intense song. What this song is, is this? Quite good for fitting the move. Oh, wow. Booted. That's something I feel like Jackal should have used in the last set. Up we got no more Jackals. We got stocks. <laughs> yeah, we got stocks and takers. If there's one thing that's worth noting for Stocks Wolf, it's that it does play fairly differently from other wolves. Yeah, for sure. He, he plays a very unorthodox style of wolf, but it works. My man will use the same option three times, but he'll use it in such an intelligent way that you can't even be pissed off about it. Like these snares, he's just been so patient with them. All right, let's see the follow-up. Getting checked with forward air. I, I, I'm trying to explain to people how Pac-Man like, has such a good kit that no one wants to talk about. Yeah. It. They love the gimmicks of the character, but they don't like really stand there to like see like what he's capable of. Like, Sinji's able to combo break with forward air or nair anytime he wants to. Like, he's able to get something started out of those aerials. Down air sets up a beautiful angle to extend his ledge play. His wow. back air. His air. tilts are also incredible. They're so quick. F tilt super quick. Bear's a great move to check aerials. And forward smash itself is reminiscent of a lot of the sword character. It's godlike. He's literally got a sword. There's so many things that he's able to do in his kit, but like, of course, a lot of the focus comes to fire hydrant, how that's utilized, bonus fruit, how that's integrated. But like, can't wow. sleep on those normals. I've never seen so many people fall out of wolf up, wolf up smash today. It's ridiculous. It reminded me of Greninja. Wow. Yeah, back there netting that kill. Sneaking in there. It, Sinji just kind of smothered him that entire game. Sinji no, normally keeps his keeps himself pretty far back, but he's just been staying in Stock's face the entire time and just checking his jumps every single time. That was an immediate drag of the token of Talent City. All right. That was crazy. Yeah. Yeah, that's what I figured. Back again to the class being lectured. All right, that guy's happy, though. They, they got hundreds on the test. They're good to go. They studied. There you go. What is Eric eating? Pop-Tart. 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 Here we go, though. So, Pac-Man's arm looks really weird. It's, it's a noodle It's like a little right. circle in his body. When it comes out. It's like he's like a Lego guy. He just plopped, plopped onto him. Don't make fun of him. Sorry, man. He's a, he looks goofy. He might be sensitive. He might first be. Time nah. He, like... In a 3D fighting game. Oh, wow. And Stock picking his trademark Palutena. This Palutena has been putting in a lot of work lately, honestly. Stock has a very deep character pool, and all of those characters are hella nice. 
He's been trying his best to practice this character a lot. Like, he's well known for various other characters. His refit puts damage down and doubles. His villagers will put him on the map. Wolf definitely leads the pack. But Pilots, I think he's very proud of how well the character is able to cover, like, matchups, character or player-wise, that he just doesn't think Wolf is able to cover on his own. He's also just able to adjust his playstyle for character. He's one player I never hear complain about uh, a character he should have gone. His biggest complaint is probably that he should have gone a character in, in spite of another, but he, he he never complains about... It's it's that, like, when you have multiple characters, you have to make the choice with yourself. Do I want to attempt to learn the matchup more with this character, or do I just want to say, maybe this character has better tools that are better equipped for this guy's playstyle? And Stock is definitely on that side where he will use the character that has the better tools to play against a certain player. All right. <laughs> I've never seen that interaction before. I've never, like, seen so and so. Whoa! Cool. Whoa! Yo, that was so cool! Right? That was godlike. Sinji, I don't want to hear you complain about New York commentary anymore, because that was really cool. All right? <laughs> that was sick. Yo, win box. Like, the win box shenanigans that you can pull off with bonus fruit leads to some of the wackiest coverage of any tool that's in this game, bar none. I'm so flabbergasted by that. He she Z dropped it into the hydro rod. It was able to follow up off of it, despite how fast that bell shot out. So I guess the bell retains its properties once it's been Z dropped, or yes. was it in this game? I know it didn't in the last game. Yeah, no. Z drop bell allows you to get the stun effect instead. That being said, though, this game has still been pretty long. Like, uh, rather so, pretty slow. Like, Stock hasn't given up too much. He's only one good back air away from taking the Stock off Sinji, and he's... That being said, though, oh my god, that was a lot of damage. Sinji's footsies have been super good this set, too. He's just been keeping Stock out with every single tool that he has at his disposal. Well, he knows that he can't, like, keep too far of a distance. Otherwise, Politeno's going to be able to cover that really well. So he's staying at more of a mid-range, and he's staying very active within that mid-range because if he gives Stock a moment to breathe, that's a moment that he could be dying. But if Stock's constantly hits on, constantly returning to the stage, constantly just being combo, like, you don't have to worry about what he's gonna do. He's worrying about you. I feel like Stock is having a hard time deciding what type of game he wants to play against Sinji right now, whether he wants to fade back and use his auto reticle to check Sinji's approaches, or if he wants to go in. I feel like he's been kind of He's almost wrestling with himself, honestly, because he just hasn't been able to find an effective game plan to get in on Sinji. He ends up right into that back air. Great back air, Sinji. <laughs> I wasn't sarcastic, by the way. That was actually really nice. I mean, it, it was a good call out because Stock has just yeah. been running rampant right into him without a game plan, I would say. Yeah, I feel, I feel like it, the, his... His moves haven't been very methodical. Like he hasn't had much meaning behind. He's, I think he's just been desperately trying to find something that works. Like we may say a, a change of character within this next game, perhaps win or lose from the stock. But it's just, a, it's a good look for Sinji. Because Palazzo is a fairly daunting character for a lot of like item-oriented brawling characters. Like really specific, gets the wide archetype and smash. Wow. And Sinji is super comfortable in this matchup. Oh, he's dead. Yeah, Stock just can't find an answer. He wants to run it back yeah, from what I just that, saw. Is he going to go Palu again? I don't know. Sometimes you just need to refresh, honestly. Yeah. I don't think we're going to see a change of character. I really don't know how Stock's Wii Fit or Villager would be able to be better equipped for this matchup. See, my I only almost feel like the Wolf was doing better. My, there's a reason to that. It is because Sinji's really comfortable fighting Palu. Okay. Let me just fit. get off the mic. Well, Sinji said it on multiple occasions how like he sees Palutena, he's ready. And this harkens back to what we were talking about a little bit earlier, where like New York, Tri-State as a whole, has so many Palutenas yeah, that a lot of all play differently. Yeah. So you have to be prepared for that matchup. Especially if it's going to be a bit more of a questionable one. And we're going into the game right now. And the resources are already all charged up on both ends. Now this this Wii Fit does play traditionally different from John Numbers, New York's finest Wii Fit. Stock's oh. Wii Fit is also amazing, but it, it displays a certain level of aggression. I want to see what he can whip out. That being said, Sinchi I think knows what to do to keep this character in disadvantage, so it's up to Stock to really become aware of that quickly, because I don't know if he's ever played Sinji with this character before. They've played very rarely in series, to my knowledge. I don't think they've ever played in doubles. But when it comes to this matchup, of course, John is, is the, uh, the bonafide weak fit of comparison. 
But it's worth noting that style-wise, it's nice. Oh, yeah. What the hell was that? Yeah, was that the hydrant? Did it bounce off the hydrant and hit Sinji? Yeah, the cherry acted wild. That was there. weird. Cherry wilding out, bro. Like, stock places, we fit like a zone break. It's really interesting because it's very counterintuitive to the character's tools. Is he going to use the hydrant? Yeah, okay. So smart. Hey. Boink, he got lucy bro. He got, he, got, he got Lucy from the Peanuts. Yeah, I don't know, man. That's so much damage. So fast. I, I just think Stock doesn't have a very efficient game plan against Sinji right now. I feel like he just doesn't know what he wants. He, he he's just landing on stage with these aggressive options. He I, he's it's done. It's done. He's looking pretty frustrated. He's tight. Right you have to really maintain your composure against Sinji because if you don't, he will run away with it. Some life though. All right, <laughs> it's just. Feeling himself. He's angry. Uh, you know, he is, he's playing quite mad right now. Great. Although Stock Taker, he's adjusted well to being able to play while upset. It, it's an adaptation that he's made because... I don't know, bro. He's been shaking his head after every one of these these failed interactions. It could be a frustrating matchup. Still living. Oh, <laughs> that was That was just a weird one. No, you get hit by the bell. All right, yeah. Very Strangely, this is starting to work a little bit, actually. Well, because they're both just mashing projectiles with <laughs> yeah. reckless abandon. Sinji doesn't have time to get his game plan going because he has to respond with a button. Put stock on the, the D1 team. Oh, okay, bro. Nah, that was your fault, bro. Don't be mad about that. That was completely your fault. Why would you roll into Melon, bro? It moves so slow. Yeah, that, that's my last. This is looking tough. It's tough, but, you know, it's still doable. It's still doable. I just don't think Stock is mentally in it anymore. He, since he's just built up so much momentum and he's kept his composure the entire time, it, it, it really hurts to see it because, like, I think Stock is a great player, but when his headspace isn't in it correctly, it can, it can become daunting. Almost netting it even without the deep breathing buff. He can squeeze this game out, though. Yes. So long as he has deep breathing buff, so long as he keeps up a very aggressive zoning war with Sinji, he just needs to maintain the the percentage rate. What? Oh, his Nair missed grabbing the bell. Oh, that's so unfortunate. Yeah, nothing more than I can say that. Uh, just relax, you know? That's such an unlucky interaction. Ungly. He got hit by the ungly right there, bro. That was, that was an ugly hitbox. Sinji just showing that composure that to get through that set. It just felt strangely stock. I feel like if he was more calm and he adapted that game plan earlier, because he found what worked finally. Yeah. However, he was so pissed off by the time he found it, he just wasn't able to function anymore. And Sinji was like just ice cold the entire time. Well, yeah. When you're Sinji in this situation, you have to remain stoic. Yeah, absolutely. Because this is nothing new for Sinji. I mean, Sinji always looks like he's at a funeral at all times. It's a matter but of. But he's a stone himself. cold killer. He's got to stay cold. Because he sees people getting mad at his style of play all the time. And that's fine. That's what he wants. That's what if, it, if that's what it takes to win, if that's his style of play, that's what you got to do. So I don't know how many other top eight qualifiers we have left coming up. I'm sure Kelvin will enlighten us with his beautiful angelic voice very shortly. We got to check. What's, what's going on? Papa Kelvin, enlighten All us. Right. So let's see what we got for you guys. I actually think... Are that we, is the last we? match before top. Actually, wait, no. We have uh, one more. Yeah, we have one more. We have one oh, more surprise. Oh, what's our, what's our he pulled the Sakurai, bro. Got, Kelvin just pulled the Sakurai so on us. So we are waiting on the loser of Tweak versus Rivers. And okay. whoever that oh, will be wow. playing Juice. And that will be a top eight qualifier, and that will be streamed up next. Tweak and Rivers Ooh. already. So uh, hold down the fort, gentlemen. All right. I'm down. We got it. We got any ad cards. I think, shill time. I, I think it's a shill time. I think shill we got time. the good sell because we got a lot of good people that are involved in this event. I yeah. think they got to get the good. Absolutely. Love. Shout outs to uh, RJ for just putting this little shindig together. It, this has been the most stacked together. event that Tri City has had in quite some time, and it has been running beautifully. Yeah, you know, considering like we like I know internet side like. The tournament went so well that all the problems had to happen completely outside of everyone's control. Yeah. yeah. So I actually want to make a statement about Ooh. that. Let's hear I, it. I just want to let you know Ooh. that today's stream, it, it literally was just the IST. It was out of our control. We tried switching the switches. We tried switching okay. the wires. What is, so what does ISP everything. mean for those who internet don't know what ISP provider. means? So okay. Optimum, Verizon, Comcast, 
there was outages in the area, so okay. there was nothing in our power that we could do to save the stream other than to wait for them to fix it. Yeah. Luckily, it's gotten better as time went on. Um, we had a little shortage uh, a few minutes ago, but luckily it came back on. So just want to let you guys know that this isn't like, you know, production side of Yeah, exactly. This is, this is just out, out of our control. control. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Shout out to those of you in the stream who are still sticking around, though. I, I for one, have no patience whatsoever when it comes to stuff like this. But if those of you who are still watching, you get to see some good-ass smash. So you really, you really props do. to y'all for being patient enough to stay in.